getting the job. I found myself a high school student washing dishes in a restaurant, graduating to a cook because they needed one, and that was the first time I stepped in a kitchen. Then I went back in the kitchen and started yelling and screaming, and, and Ramsey would have taken notes from me. Then. <laughs> Film was a huge hit with the Food Network when they looked at it, and they said, okay, we want this show, and they signed on for, for a full year without even having a full show in, 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 in the can. So, and they had never done that before, so that was, that was the beginning of the heat. We didn't want to do a coffee table book that was sort of art on a plate that you would look at and then instantly shut it and put it back on the coffee table. Uh, the whole concept of the book, and, and Jacob and I sat down and we talked about it, was that I want it to be a well-used book. I'd love, it to, I'd love to see the book tabbed as I, as I see in the crowd here, that you have sticky notes and turn pages and that there's, there's splatters on the pages because that book is used and maybe it's stuck right between the sugar and the flour and the, on the kitchen counter and that, that was the whole concept behind it. So there's many, many recipes in the book that are really easily achieved and they have great flavor profiles but they, they involve interesting cooking techniques and styles and they're, they're very credible in, in what they are but they're, they're of simple language, very direct, easy, easily understood language. Because many cookbooks I read, uh, chefs go on and on and on and on, and I find that they, they, they complicate the process to the point where like a professional chef can get complicated, get confused reading their recipe in terms of how they've structured yeah. the recipe. And that's exactly what we talked about we didn't want to do.